Human Rights Watch has captured in its latest report what it describes as systematic and discrimination against gays and lesbians in the Ghanaian community. The 72-page report, titled No Choice But to Deny Who I Am, throws small light on the violence and discrimination meted against lesbians, gays, bisexuals, transgenders, and intersex LGBTI persons in the Ghanaian community. Section 104 Clause 1 B of the Criminal Offences Act 1960, Act 29, states that whoever has a natural carnal knowledge of any persons of 16 years or over with his consent is guilty of a misdemeanor. Clause 2 of Act 104 further indicates a natural carnal knowledge is sexual intercourse with a person in an unnatural manner or with an animal. So, we find out from the Shiraj boss, Joseph Whittle, what he makes out of this clash between rights and culture. The, the Criminal Offences Act criminalizes all natural canon knowledge, which is practicing uh, the act of sex not through the normal sexual organ to organ type. Any other type of sexual intercourse is unnatural. Some people are tried under it. He used the platform to throw a word of caution to the Ghanaian public not to violate the rights of these persons in the Ghanaian society, but allow the laws of the state to handle it. And we should come to an understanding that they, like all of us, are human beings. They have rights which are guaranteed under the Constitution. So, for me, as the Commissioner for Human Rights of the Republic of Ghana, I would say we should be very careful, uh, even though we are culturally, you know, conservative as a country, very religious, we should also know that we have a regime of law, especially fundamental human rights, which these people are entitled to.